a dream last night when I woke up. I remember it, but just a moment ago. Scar. My dreams keep taking pictures in my mind. Got the sun in my To the bay at night for ya Anything to get a little time with you Haven't felt like this in a while You really know how to make a girl smile Give it your time It's more than I ask when you see me Oh, you make love and you easy take Nothing for me to complete you, baby Oh, and I usually keep to myself But you give me out of my shit Good morning! Oh, two busted nails. Okay, well, it is Shay. She is back. She got the gym fit on. Looking hella cute. Got my little clips in. We looking hella cute today. Well, today, I thought I was trying something different. I've had this in my, like, I guess, what, rough drafts, video ideas that I wanted to do for a while. But I have wanted to, well, actually, I've done it on my channel before. Like, I've worked at, like, other fitness influencers. And recently, my fitness inspo has been the Learman Twins. Now, if you haven't heard of them, they are, like, famous on TikTok, famous on Instagram. They are adorable. Most fitness influencers, I feel like, have this, like, snobby attitude about them. But these girls are 18. They talk like grown women. They got their life together. They are so sweet. I've been watching their videos for a while. And recently, they just started vlogging and showing their life and how they want to become you know nurses and stuff and I'm like you know what I really relate to that because I have a science background you know I got busted nails I'm sorry <laughs> and uh, I just really wanted to say that I am inspired by them and I really hope that they watch this video because they did say if you try out their workout to tag them so I will but yeah if you guys are watching this you really inspire me you guys are body goals and I really love how one thing they really hammer home is that genetics plays a huge huge impact on your game so obviously they have great genetics they're blessed you know we both have curly hair today we are going to hit their ultimate booty workout okay and i already know i'm finna be sore all right so we got our protein pancakes hit that protein intake I got my diy digestion shots i'm a little bloated this morning and we gonna get some groceries today healthy groceries so let's go to gym okay, first let's take this together okay Cheers. Oh, a lot of spices. <laughs>
into is hip thrusts. We're gonna do four sets of 10, and then we're gonna superset with 10 reps. Hey, voiceover on here. I'm gonna be going over the placement for Smith Machine hip thrusts. Once you're all set up on the machine, place your legs a couple inches in front of you with your feet about shoulder width apart. Before pushing the weight up, brace your core and make sure you maintain a neutral and flat back throughout the set. These days I do anything I like. Got it for this life every day and night. When I left, I told them I would get it right. Yeah, yeah. Break bread and break hearts. Don't get me started now. Break up, you break down. I'm getting money now. Fuck love. This is on a second set. Holy crap, I'm winded. I feel this all in my glutes, great and VR glute dominant, to mainly focus the stressor of pushing the weight up through your heels to optimize the growth in the muscle right here. Make sure that your back and your core stay neutral, stomach stays tucked to maintain like that mobility, because if you start to go like this, it's gonna feel on your so lower back and it's gonna hurt. Work out. <laughs> To break down, I'm getting money now. Fuck love, I can't trust. I'm too damn jaded now. Break laws, got love, child. Oh, sorry, tweaking now. I fell in love with a moolah. I need my wrist like a cooler. She got get hit like a tutor. Wanna love, but she a loser. Me and my brothers ran through her. She know that I'm a straight shooter. So my chick bad like Luda. Ooh, I'm gonna pull a study to the side. She keep coming at me every day and night. When I left in my life, started feeling right, yeah. I just want to add, like I said, we're using the Smith machine. This may look like a lot of weight, but the bar is only 15 pounds. Like, this is only 15 pounds. Normal barbell, 45 pounds, okay? So, just finished um, our rest time. We normally probably about two to three minutes of rest time in between, like, sets. Freshed and can hit it harder. You'll notice a difference between like your rest time and how much you're able to lift after your next set. Um, right now we're going into dumbbell RDLs. Um, we're gonna do four sets of 12 for these. Squeeze your booty at the top and to make it more glute focused, have a slight bend in your knees and make sure you keep your back straight when you go down and up. You wanna push your hips back. Go down, you know, only go as far as your hamstrings are willing to go because that's when your form is gonna start to crash and it's just gonna hurt, your back is gonna hurt. Off the fucking line, I got hella bands on me. Fuck a sing along, they don't have a bang on me. While I got this guy, only talking big money. Cause I love the guy, I'm the big man. So the next thing that we're gonna do is leg press. He sets, lifting, like going super heavy. And we'll talk about our placement and everything as well on that because the muscle that you engage using that machine does vary by your foot placement. Hey, voiceover on is back, and I'm just going to be going over the foot placement. So, as far as, like, width, um, it's just pretty standard, you know. Shoulder width placement is great for overall leg development. However, what makes this a little bit different is our foot placement is a little bit higher, um, and that puts more emphasis on the glutes and hamstrings. So, that is what you are seeing me do as of right now, lifting super heavy, engaging those glutes and obviously a little bit of the hamstrings it's inevitable but yeah so in a fresh cash no tic tacs my life look like six flags they big mad i know that bitch i'm front of me so you know my fit on chip 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 since they love me when i hit that bitch then tip 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 yeah i got too much on my mental because i done made it out of central now i'm the one they show the into but I can't ever love a bitch like ooh. I'm gonna pull a study to the side. So next, we're doing hip extensions. Okay, so when you do this, you wanna make sure that your core is like tucked. And it's mm. honestly gonna look like you're arching your back, but at the same time, you need to do like the ugly grandma squeeze. Like, tuck your core, ugly grandma squeeze, like with your butt. Or and squeeze after every single rep. Yeah. And so we're gonna do three sets of 20 for this. I know it's a lap, but you're, you're gonna feel the burn. And then afterwards, we're gonna superset with um, your, our body weight. And you wanna make sure that the padding rests like right before your hips. Yep. When I left in my life, started feeling right Yeah, yeah, ooh These days I do anything I like Grinding for this life every day and night I'm dead 
Look at the glue pump. I am so sorry. She looking bad though. She looking tick. A glute focus workout. Mm -hmm. Build the booty. Build that shelf. Okay, so after that, we both finished with a little bit of cardio. I did Stairmaster, she did incline treadmill. So that'll also be a way to just like finish the workout, feel the pump, walk it off. Mm -hmm your yeah. heart rate up if you do the workout take videos take pictures tag us tag us and we'll repost you we want to see we want to see how it works for y'all Give it time, 